Right then. This is video five. Couple of walkers going along down there. I changed my plan. I was going to go and follow the stream along and follow the base of the fort and then go along the bottom there. But because I'd done most of that the other week, I, I did a bit of exploring in, in the warren instead, in the cool. Um, yeah, I did a little bit of a wandering about in the cool. Otherwise, I mean, if I'd really wanted to do the lower bit, I just followed where those people are. Gone straight down, nearly to the bottom, then followed a track going across the, near the, not the very bottom, but along, and then I would still would have had to climb up. And I've done that climb up before now, and it's not easy. I can still change my mind now if I really wanted to. When I get up to the, what I call the parade track, I could always turn round, turn left, and, and go down that and join it. But I'm not going to today. No, it's a, it's a gorgeous day just for not overdoing it, I think. There's plenty of other times to come out. But of course, you've got to make the most of the summer light. But it doesn't apply to me if I use bus, because the last bus is always six o'clock, whether it's summer or winter. So, I only need my vehicle if I know, like when I go on the Quantox, I have to have Alberta. Because there is no bus. A very, very restricted time one. It's no good for long walking. Of course, you know, with the summer, I am restricted because of our furry friends and cows. There's lots of walks I do in the colder months, which I'd love to do in the summer. But, um, I don't talk about them quite as much as I used to. I do like cows, by the way. And there's a plane. Easy jet coming into Bristol Airport there, look. It's a plane you see the most around here. I don't know if we'll be able to see it land. Down onto the runway there, there's one of the seven bridges. Yeah, looks like it landed, that was smooth, wasn't it? So yeah, there we go. Everyone's relieved they got there safely. That's Bristol Airport, Bristol International Airport, which has expanded over the years. Quite a busy airport. There it is, now it's got to just bus itself into position. It's good being able to see all that, isn't it? Bus itself into position, then the passengers can get off. Over and out. And in a minute there'll be another one. They don't stop coming, actually. There'll be another one very soon. It's a bit like Heathrow Airport, eh? Yeah? All right, over and out.